One in five Americans suffer from chronic pain, and with all the dangers of opioid use, many are looking for alternative treatments that are both safe and effective. Consumer Reports explores the latest research on everything from supplements to sleep. Nancy Ortiz has been in pain for years. I feel the pain in my low back, very strong. And in, in the morning, I can't even walk. She's been working with a pain management doctor. I always tell patients the first thing to do is do the least invasive for your body. A recent CDC report shows that of the 50 million Americans in pain, 20 million say it's so severe it limits their ability to work, socialize, or take care of themselves and their family. So what can people do? There's no magic bullet. Lasting solutions are usually made up of several different kinds of treatment. The American College of Physicians recommends trying non-drug measures first. Consider types of exercise that incorporate mindfulness, like Tai Chi and yoga. Acupuncture and massage have also shown to help some with chronic back pain and fibromyalgia. Another option might be something called cognitive behavioral therapy. And that's where you work with a therapist on changing how you approach your pain. Many turn to supplements, but for most, there's no data to show those work. But there is preliminary research to suggest that cannabidiol, or CBD, the non-psychoactive compound in the marijuana plant, can reduce the inflammation. Other people try over-the-counter drugs like ibuprofen or acetaminophen or topical pain relievers in a cream or a patch. Prescription drugs used for pain include antidepressants, muscle relaxants, and opioids, which of course come with the risk of addiction or misuse. But when nothing else works... I always say the last resort is to go for surgery. Well, if your doctor does recommend surgery, we've got the three questions on our website. Consumer Reports says you should always ask first. Am I even a good candidate? Next, are there any other options? And lastly, what result can I actually expect? Right now, if you're struggling with addiction or you know someone who is, we have a special section on newsforjex.com. It has direct access to both local and national resources. To help fight this epidemic, just head to newsforjex.com slash opioids.